It has taken over the internet and it still doesn't officially have a name. Fans of The Mandalorian on Disney Plus call it Baby Yoda, but the show only refers to the creature as the child. We don't even know if it's a he or a she. What we do know is local animals at Wild Wonders and Bonzel are helping provide the voice for Baby Yoda. News 8 photojournalist Brian White takes us to the refuge. The Mandalorian sound crew came out here and they decided on a bad-eared fox and a kinkajou for Baby Yoda's voice. It was a, a unique project to work on, one that we haven't done before. <laughs> Our battered fox, her name is Acacia, and Acacia is just 14 years old now. Battered foxes are found in Southern Africa. They live in family groups. Uh, they're together for life. They're amazing social little foxes. The vocalizations that you are hearing were actually some of her greetings and some of her happy sounds. So this is Forrest. He's one of eight kinkajous that we have here at Wild Wonders. Kinkajous uh, are nocturnal, so they do vocalize quite a bit uh, throughout the rainforest. They have all kinds of different vocalizations that they make. Um, the ones that they used her here were mainly um, territorial vocalizations. And they did such a masterful job of being able to blend animals in with uh, real babies. Voices to make a baby Yoda. How neat is that local connection? Wild Wonders is an animal sanctuary and education center with about 100 animals that were either rescued or confiscated. For more information, we've linked their site to ours. Just go to the hot button at CBS8.com.